Hi, this is David Armstrong back with another of our Musical Theatre Factory vlogs. And my guest today is the one and only Kendra Kassebaum, who is currently starring as Jovi in our production of Elf here at the Fifth Avenue. But Kendra is no stranger to our stage. <laughs> How many shows have you been in at the Fifth Avenue now? Company, Secret Garden, Cinderella, Little Night Music, Elf, five. Five. Really amazing. We keep having her back because she's just <laughs> that damn good. So happy about that. <laughs> and Kendra also, in addition to being one of the stars of the Fifth Avenue, is one of Broadway stars. She starred as Glinda in Wicked on Broadway and yes. a number of Broadway shows. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, Assassins. Assassins. Uh, Rent was my debut. That's right. That's right. I and remember when you got that job. Yeah. I've known Kendra a long time. Yes. He gave Very me some, one of my, kind of like my first jobs, like... I got. I had did one show, and then you gave me the. It was um, Hello Dolly. Hello Dolly. Yeah. Yeah. At the Summerstock Theater. Yeah. And uh, it was she was fantastic. <laughs> that was and great. the rest is history. So <laughs> tell us that you're back for your second year mm -hmm. as at, with the holidays. Yes. So what's it like? I and mean, we always we you know I, we love having you any time of the year, but a uh, holiday show is really special at the mm -hmm. Fifth Avenue. We'll talk a little bit about that. What, it what, is. It's like it's kind of like what you bring up sometimes with the pre uh, the pre show speeches. Is like it's a tradition for a lot of families to come, um, and it's a lot of times Christmas presents that they get right. to come to the theater, and it's a special night, and it you know puts everyone in the holiday mood. You're downtown with all the lights and everything, so it just kind of makes it special and. Um, and then just the, just the whole aspect of it bringing families together to come see a show is it's fun and you feel that kind of energy you know. And what's it like backstage? Talk about the backstage energy. Backstage, during... well, we're our lovely dysfunctional family that's <laughs> we're together for the holidays and we're truly our family. It's there's some secret Santas going on. There's probably sweets every day. Like there's always somebody making food, but it's a really festive atmosphere. We've got lights hanging. We've got decorations. I mean, it's, you know, so you've got like this 100 person <clears throat> family backstage exactly. during the holidays. Yeah. And we're all kind of like helping us get through and, and, um, you know, kind of sharing in the joy of Christmas. And tell us a little bit about Jovi. What's the, what, did you, had you seen the movie? Were you, mm -hmm. did I saw you? saw the movie a long time ago. Yeah. And, uh, Jovi is your cynical New Yorker. Which I you've guess. known a few, I bet. I've known a few, yeah. <laughs> the city can do that to you sometimes. The city can it can bring out the roughness in you that we all kind of have, I think. And how long did you live in New York? Um, almost, like, 14 and a half years. Uh, and where do you live now? Right now I live in Magnolia neighborhood. <laughs> so you're I love one of it. our... Kendra's one of our amazing yes. people who have had a great career mm -hmm. in New York, continue to have a great career in New York. Uh, you were just in a Broadway show last season. And yet, want to live and want to yeah. want to work here as much as possible. And I knew possible. the minute whenever I did the first show with you here, I knew, you know, back in my 20s, I knew that I was like, I know I'm going to come back here and live here. Hmm. And then I got New York out of, kind of out of my system. I wanted a different quality of life. And so, I'm here trying it. It's kind of like starting over again. Yeah. Yeah. But you got some good connections here. Yeah. <laughs> I know some people. You know some people. So where are you off to next? You're, you're, um, uh, you, you don't just work here, you work yes. other places. Yeah, I was very fortunate to, um, I'm good at, I did a co-production of Next to Normal with Arizona Theater Company, and we're doing it at, in San Jose, uh, starting in, in after, right after, I leave a, little, a week early. Right. And, um, so if any of you have friends or relatives who are going to be visiting San Jose over the next uh, you know, month. When, yeah. when's, the, when's the close? How I think long? around February 1st. So January, mm -hmm. February. All yeah, the time. and it's a great production. You can see Next to Normal, which of course we did a, We did the national tour of uh, two years ago, and people really, it was, it was a, actually kind of a big hit for us. Yeah. And uh, Kendra's going to be playing show. that amazing part yeah. of, the, of the mother. I wish it for all actresses to be able to do that part. Great. It's delicious. And what a contrast to go from Jovi I know. to Diana, is that her name? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. It was the best because I was like, oh my gosh, because it's a heavy, it's a really heavy piece and, and, it, and it takes you to dark places. And then I was so excited to, to be able to just let that go and have kid-like fun in Elf. Right, the joy. It, yeah, and the, the, Eric, the director, that's what he said. He was like, this show is about having belief again and kind of getting back to that place as a kid. And that was so welcomed after that kind of a run. It's great. Yeah. Well... 
Thank you, Kendra. Thank Thanks. you. We'll, you'll be back, I have no doubt. I hope. <laughs> and have a wonderful holiday, everybody Thank out you. there. Thank Merry you. Merry Christmas. Bye. Bye-bye.